Hey everyone, Nels Heiberg, and I have another unboxing today, this time Scrawler Box. So this is another one that arrives from another country. This one comes from England, and as you can probably guess from the name, Scrawler Box, it contains art supplies, typically pens, pencils, maybe paint pens, watercolor brushes, and a couple of things of paper so you can draw and create on them. And I fully admit I'm a pen addict. Around this house, I've got to have a couple of hundred in jars and in drawers and just sitting in every room. So that's what I love about these. And this, um, as you can see, we get the, the customs declaration on it. So it does come from there. This was sent um, February 20th and it's February 28th so it came in about a week and not too bad at all I'm on the eastern US so that could be part of it but scrawler box subscription art supplies I'll have the URL in the description below so you can check it out so let's see what we have to draw write, and create with this month so I want to be careful with the box because I do I love these boxes they're great for storing um, art supplies or all kinds of things and I have had a tendency in the past to tear through uh, this box in particular and I want to do that I want to be able to use it for things and there's lots of secure tape which is necessary considering that it does come across the ocean literally okay so we have Right there, no. Nope. Just pulling out the tabs eventually. Okay, so for Scrawler Box, we have this okay, hidden by the tissue paper. Um, I'm already tearing it, I just get too excited. So I've opened the tissue paper, and oh, there's a lot. Okay. Uh, always comes with their sticker, which I have on my bike, and some other things. They always send a card that lists the items on the back. I'm not looking. I'll see that in a minute. They also give a challenge each month. I'm not sure. I'll hold that up if that's readable. Um, but they always give a theme. This one is Quiet Morning. There will be an art piece in here that someone created with that theme using these supplies. So they always say to create something and then post it online, give the hashtag Scrawler Challenge, and you can see what other people are doing with these supplies. But we have, uh, see, I, I can't remember if this is the one that has different kinds of boxes, but what I love, I mean, different levels, but I love the quality of materials. I mean, I just see Faber-Castle, and I know this is going to be good. And here we have 12 Gold Faber Aqua Pencils. So watercolor pencils. Okay, watercolor pencils. I'm mentioning the Gold fa um, Faber. I, so I wonder if they're in the gold variety um, made in Germany. Let me see the English on the back. 12 pencils. Okay, looks like these are the colors here that we have. So a nice range typically um, for watercolor and... Uh, let me see, the first is in Dutch. Excellent light fastness, soft, vibrant colors, highly pigmented, fully water soluble lead, high break resistance um, due to secural bonding process. Again, I see that name, I know that quality, and that's the kind of stuff you get here. So we have this little um, tin. Yes, um, it's in the plastic, but this nice tin of storage. So we have that. Then there is this pencil, 4B. And it is a typical drawing pencil. Again, quality. Stadler. Love their stuff. So I know that this is good, very sturdy, and goes with the... Oh, again, this is pencil sharpener, but I don't think you can tell. It's metal. So it is very going to be very strong um, and great with the pencil. Then we have... Oh! I think just a little candy, a little watermelon, melon, it says bubble, Ooh, maybe bubble gum, bubble gum, yeah, that's what it says, okay, I'm going to have that as I post the video, a Stadler eraser, so for the pencil, and again, good quality name, product, so, yeah, Mars plastic, um, typical white eraser, very, very good, then there is, okay, is this too 
cold water. Another Faber-Castell, yeah, water brush. It says at the bottom. So I know I've got the glare, but you can see that we have, um, let's see if I can open this easily. Um, the water brush so you can use the watercolor pencils. Okay, so this, yeah, this little kind of brush, fill it, and then you can use that water there, the brush um, with the pencils. So yes, all meant to go together, um, all, yeah, just unscrew it, put the water in, um, that's perfect. So the pencils, the brush, and then a pencil, eraser, and the sharpener. So a good set of usable things. Um, ooh, nice. Looks like this is what someone created. The featured artist, let's see if I can, I wanna get the blue reflection off the screen, Carla Kochow. Um, if I mispronounce your name, sorry, Carla. Carla Kochow is a graduate of Information Communications Technology Management from De La Salle University, Manila, so the Philippines. Um, she's a full-time project manager and a watercolor painter and art teacher. So this is the piece that we have this month. Her Instagram is on it. I'll make sure to include that in the description. But it looks sounds like if she um, is a watercolor artist, um, she does watercolor workshops, watercolor workshops and art demos for brands like Faber Castle. So using those materials to create this beautiful piece here. And I said they always include at least one little piece of sketch paper so you can practice and play yourself, which I'll break out the watercolors in a bit and play around and see what we have. So that is Scrawler Box. And until the next box arrives, I'm Nels Heiberg.